Well, good evening, everybody. We'd like to welcome you tonight to our December 4th Hendersonville Regional Planning Commission meeting. We'd like to call this meeting to order, and at this time, I'd like us to stand, and Commissioner Altizer is going to open in prayer. Please bow your heads. Thank you so much, Lord, for this beautiful day, and thank you for all the blessings you've bestowed upon us in the city. Thank you again for this city, Lord. Thank you for this commission and help guide us, help put your hand on us to make us make good decisions for the people in this community. Thank you for all the blessings, Lord. Watch over us as we go through our ways and the holidays and keep us all safe. And again, Lord, thank you for sending Jesus Christ to die for our sins. All this we pray in his name. Amen. 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 You may be seated. Uh, by way of roll call tonight, let me make the comment that uh, every commissioner is here with respect except for Commissioner Lee and Commissioner Stringfellow. I think Ms. Commissioner Stringfellow is on her way. And also I'd like to welcome tonight uh, Alderman uh, Woodcock to our uh, Planning Commission. Daryl, welcome to the Planning Commission. Glad you're here. So, and um, we will also be hearing from... Uh, Commissioner Roberson at the end of the meeting tonight, but this will be his last evening to serve with us. He I want to congratulate him on his election. There comes Commissioner Stringfellow right now. Uh, congratulate him on his election to uh, Ward 6 for our Board of Mayor and Alderman. Okay, so uh, we'll move on tonight. We have one public hearing on the calendar, and we have nobody signed up. Um, but that is a request by uh, Jost LLC to rezone 3.010 acres from industrial to heavy commercial. The property is located on the east side of Tennessee Way, south of Volunteer Drive, as identified on Sumner County Tax Map 160MA025.00. As I said, nobody signed up, so we'll declare that hearing closed. Is there any request for information and assistance? Okay, hearing none. Uh, move on to the minutes. Do we have a motion? Motion, motion to approve by Ms. Silkwood, second by uh, Ms. Mr. Millsaps. All in favor say aye. Aye. Any no? Any abstentions? Ms. Ashley abstains. We have several items on the consent agenda tonight. Two items Lake Harbor Section 4, Savannah uh, Phase 8, Section 1. Would entertain a motion to group and approve? Move to group and approve. Okay, we have a motion to group, motion to approve. Any second? Ms. Batchley seconds. All in favor say aye. Aye. All right. Final plats. There are none. Preliminary and final development plans. Festival Center, racetrack. Uh, Mr. Free, who's handling this one? Uh, Timothy Witten. Mr. Witten. Uh, this is the FDP follow-up to the preliminary development plan um, that the Planning Commission and, and Obama approved a few months ago. Um, it's the, the same plan. It is in substantial compliance with the PDP. Uh, this FTP only covers the racetrack site itself, um, and the applicants have agreed to all staff comments. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Witten. Uh, any questions by any commissioners? Move to approve. Move to approve by Ms. Atchley. Do I have a second? Second. Second by uh, Mr. Altizer. All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? So ordered. Move on to... Uh, Site plans, which is uh, racetrack, festival center. Mr. Witten? Uh, yes, this is the, the site plan, uh, which follows the FDP approval. Um, just it's the same plan, again, just a little bit more, bit more detail from the FDP. Um, if you do approve this, the approval will be conditioned on uh, BOMA's approval of the FDP, which y'all just approved. And the applicants have agreed to all staff comments. Okay, thank you very much, Mr. Witten. Do we have a motion? So moved. Moved by Mr. Millsap, second by Ms. Atchley. Uh, all in favor, any, any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? So ordered. Rezoning request, uh, 105 Tennessee Way rezoning. Um, who's handling this one, Mr.? Uh, this would be Grant Green. Grant, go ahead. <coughs> thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, this is a rezoning request uh, from I to HC. Uh, this is requested by Baker Roofing, uh, who has a contract to buy 3.01 uh, acres on Tennessee Way, which is south of Volunteer Drive. This is what we uh, had the public hearing for about five minutes ago. And uh, it's a straight zoning. There's no way to, uh, to really ensure that uh, 
um, another heavy commercial use wouldn't be constructed with the straight zoning. However, it's more common in our industrial areas to, to do a, a straight uh, zoning request. And, and uh, um, I guess, uh, you know, it's not unlike, it's our planned development, you know, it, typically it, it, it has uh, has more of, a, of a, a set criteria for, for what is uh, required, but, uh, you know, with, with it being the, the straight zoning, it, it, you know, we do think that it would be, um, you know, what, what they based their letter on, it, it sounds reasonable uh, in terms of, of the area and everything, but, uh, they have stated they wish to construct a 20,000 square foot office and warehouse space at that location, and uh, I think are they currently? I think they're currently located in Goodlettsville, from what I understand. So, uh, but uh, this is uh, there is some HC zoning that is adjacent to it, um, and uh, most of that area is industrial. So it's it's it does kind of fit that that general area. Thank you, Mr. Green. Do we have any questions? Um, from the commissioners to Mr. Green about the zone, rezone. Okay, hearing none. Uh, move to approve. Ms. Ashley makes the motion, second by Ms. Stringfellow. Any more discussion? All in favor to recommend the reason. We also need to move in that motion that uh, finding a fact, uh, if somebody wants to, uh, um, uh, we've got a motion and a second on the floor, but the fact that the zone change amendment is in agreement with the land use plan for the area. There be no adverse effect to the adjoining property owners unless such effect can be justified. Um, so there's no adverse effect. And there are no property owners or small group property owners that will benefit materially from the change to the detriment of the general public. And so, Ms. Beery, we need to make that reflected. The maker of the motion and the I'll second. Of crude include all that? Okay. Yeah. All right. And do we modify the second? Okay. okay. Oh, uh, very good. All in favor say aye. Uh -huh. And opposed? Okay, very good. So it's so ordered. Yeah, it'll go to Boma. Yeah, this yeah. will go to Boma. It goes on to them next. Okay. So you did good. <laughs> you did real well. <laughs> yes, please. That'd be great. Thank you very much. How many employees are you going to have? Uh, sir, we're going to range, right now currently we have 90 employees and we're looking to grow to business to somewhere about 150 Great. over the next over the next three years. Great. That's awesome. Um, Great. And again, family-owned business, I uh, apologize for getting the elsewhere like that. That's fine. Um, family-owned business, fourth generation, I've been with them practically 16 years. Um, this is just some of the things we've done in Nashville since we've been here uh, since 2010. You. You'll recognize a lot of those nice buildings downtown. Um, just recently started a residential department about a year and a half ago. Um, done a lot of work in Hendersonville. I live in Hendersonville, been in Hendersonville five years myself, me and my family. Um, and uh, so the projects in Hendersonville, Indian Lake Elementary School, Hendersonville High School, uh, Gallatin High School, Howard Elementary School, uh, First Tennessee Bank in Hendersonville. So multiple projects my company has done, me and my, my team has done in this city. Uh, yes. we, we would love to get here. We're currently in Madison. We've been there six years um, this past August. So we are, we are, I want us to get to Hendersonville as fast as we can. Well, we're looking forward to having you. We're trying to pave the way for you. Fantastic. <laughs> thank you very much. And I apologize for taking my line. You're okay. <laughs> Fan, thank, you, thank you for the materials. Absolutely. My phone's on there. Any questions, please give me a call. Thank you. Okay, we have uh, staff reviewed projects that are approved at Mer Aldi at Merchant Point, uh, 209 Campus Drive, a parking lot expansion, Walton Ferry exterior renovations, then staff reviewed projects pending, Alexander and Connor subdivision, Exxon cooler addition and renovation, Fountain Brook Phase 2 Section 1 <coughs> resub lots, uh, Messenger and Sill properties, the racetrack final plat, Michael Archibald Phase 2, Old Beaverwood Recording Studio, parking lot correction. Uh, so, that's funny. Saundersville Industrial Park Section 7, Resub Lot 70, and the Taco Bell. And then we have, uh, that requires no action on our parts. Uh, we have one resolution, 2018-04. Uh, it's the resolution for Waterford Crossing Phases 2 and 3 Street Acceptance. Do we have a, a motion? So moved. 
Moved by Ms. McCormick. Second. Second. Second by Ms. Datchley. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? So ordered. Carried. Unanimously. All right. And at this point, uh, we're going to move to uh, uh, planning director comments. And then I'm going to give uh, Mr. Roberson a chance of personal privilege. So, Mr. Mr. Free. Yes. Uh, the only comments I have this evening are uh, to remind everybody to get back in touch with Sydney after you've completed that one-hour uh, video training that we sent on property rights. Uh, also, uh, remember about the uh, holiday banquet that'll be Thursday, December 13th at six o'clock, and uh, make sure to confirm your attendance uh, with Lauren. That's it. Thank you, Mr. Free and uh, Mr. Roberson. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. My wife said, why are you going tonight? I said, well, because I, I understand that Miss Silkwood is going to bring us candy, <laughs> and I didn't want to miss out on the goodies. So thank you, uh, Vanessa, for remembering Christmas early. Uh, Mr. Chairman and members of the Planning Commission, as already stated, I wish to inform you that this will be my last meeting as a member of this commission. I appreciate the mayor's appointment of me to this commission almost a year ago and the welcome that you have given me as a new member. Uh, we've not always agreed on particular issues, but we are united in moving our city forward. This commission is important to the future of our city. Your decisions do more to shape our city than any other committee or commission uh, in Hendersonville. I applaud your service and look forward to receiving your decisions as a new alderman. May God give you wisdom in your service in the days ahead. And for my own time on the, the, on the commission, I leave with a simple sine die. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Robeson, and we appreciate your service to our planning commission. And uh, let me just say, as the chairman, Merry Christmas to all of you. And uh, we're so appreciative of all of your service on this planning commission, especially to our commissioners as well as our staff and our staff director we're looking forward to being with you at our at our banquet coming up and with that do we have a motion mr chairman i move that we stand adjourned we have a motion to adjourn do i have a second second, second. second. mr altizer all in favor say aye aye we are adjourned Thank you.